Alright, welcome to the very first video I've made in a long little while. A long little while, because that's not contradictory at all. Okay, so, it's been a bad little week. I won't go into why, but I finally just got around to making a video now. And what I'm going to do is, oh, as well as announcing that it's been a bad week, hence no videos and whatnot, I'm going to show off the virtual machines that I've got set up. This is the... How do you pronounce Zubuntu? Xubuntu, the version of Ubuntu that runs XFCE? I don't know how you pronounce that, but anyway. I've got it set up here. I remember the password. The password is ensure this. Because John Trebet here works for an insurance company. And this is his work computer, of course. And this is the virtual machine I've got set up. Ah, VBox editions. That should not be enabled. Let me just remove that from the drive. In fact, I won't force and mount it. I shall open up the X file explorer thingy and eject it. There we go, good. But yeah, this is the X Ubuntu, or however you pronounce that, virtual machine I've got set up. I made sure to have Wine installed this time. I've got Wine set up nicely. Is that how you find out the version of Wine? I forget. Or is it Double Dash? Double hyphen. Yeah, Wine Double Dash for hyphen version, and we've got Wine 1.6.2. So I should be able to run the remote control software they give me, and it, it obviously won't work. Well, well, some of it won't work. But yeah, that should run nicely. And I've also got, of course... The internet set up, hence pinggoogle.com, because that works. And, yeah, I remember the password. It's all set up rather nicely, and it's basically as plain as, day, as plain as plain can be. Nothing fancy, it's just Linux, basically. And, yeah. Right, so what I'm going to show you next is the next virtual machine. I'm just going to power it off, because I've got no real... um care for shutting it down properly, it's only a virtual machine. I also have, let me just that, Windows NT 4.0. Let me start that up. Nope, oh, it's loaded up on the wrong screen. Let me just fix that. Uh, view, switch to full screen. Don't show that again, please. Right, there we go. Windows NT 4.0. This is, of course, incredibly lovely. <laughs> I purposely picked the most horrible looking, well, it's not the most horrible looking, but um, I picked the worst appearance scheme thing that I could find. I picked the most, um, the strangest looking, because I'm sure anyone who used Windows back in the day remembered this thing. This it, weird and horrible color scheme thing, and ugh. But yeah. I chose the lilac large one because it looks kind of weird. And honestly, I like the large version because it makes it feel like... Like I don't know what I'm doing. You know, like... And no offense to people who are aged 80 or so, but it makes me, it seem like I'm... An 80-year-old who's clueless about computers. If you see where I'm going with that, you know? It feels like that. I actually want to show window content while dragging. Yeah, good. I was looking for that before and I couldn't find it. Good. Uh, but yeah, this is Windows NT 4.0. Let's just try the um, acid test. Because this is, of course, Internet Explorer 6.0. This will not work, work very well. At all. It's probably not going to work at all. <laughs> Problems with this web page indeed. Wow. Yeah, that's the worst looking acid test result I've ever seen. Uh, but anyway, that's not the point of this video. The point of this video is just to sh show off these virtual machines. And this is Windows NT 4.0. Oh, I actually want to get rid of that. How do I... I don't remember how to do things in Windows NT. It's been such a long time. Um, where are the users? Where's the users directory? It's not WinNT, is it? No, it doesn't appear to be. Are there are there things hidden, perhaps? Options, show all files. Okay, full path and title bar. No, da da da. da, da okay, where is it? 
wow, I actually do not remember my way around here. Documents, read me? Where's the read me? F wow. Well, that's just bad. Um, I really genuinely don't remember how to find my things. Wow. Um... Yeah, okay, and I'm going to stop looking now, because that's getting rather embarrassing. I really do not remember Windows NT. But, yeah, this is Windows NT, and I'm going to... I'm really anxious to see how the scammers are going to respond to this. As to whether the remote control software will work at all. Now, I don't want to go to ami.com, because it'll pop up and they might notice it or something, but maybe I'm giving them too much credit. I don't know. I really don't know. But, yeah, Windows NT and... Xubuntu, or however you meant to pronounce that, 14.01 or 14.04. Either way, it doesn't really matter. Yeah, I've got... Oh, dear. Can I hide the virtual box guest editions thing? I guess not. Uh, but yeah, these are the virtual machines, and I shall be calling them at some point in the next few days. At some point, when things clear up a little bit, because it's still a bad week, but... Yeah. Thank you very much for watching, and goodbye for now. I think I'm actually going to record a random Minecraft map tonight, just to get something out there, you know, that's not this announcement video. But anyway, thank you very much for watching, and goodbye for now. I shall see you in the next one, and I will leave you here looking at the beautiful Windows NT 4.0 desktop. <laughs> Bye for now.